Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So if you ask me, I'd say one of the most powerful strategies in dropshipping right now is to take a past proven verified winning product that has sold really, really well in one of the countries that everybody talks about when it comes to dropshipping on YouTube. So um, obviously America, UK, Australia, Canada. So to take a product from one of those countries everybody talks about and sell it and take it and sell it in a country that nobody is talking about and just to prove to you how powerful this strategy can be today i want to share with you a shopify dropshipping store that's been in business for two years called golden memories so if i was to show you this product here which is a necklace and inside this like um glass um sphere when you look in it up close, you've probably seen the ads before, people talking about this product for years. This product is as old as three or four years, maybe even a bit further back. So when you look inside the glass globe, you can see a picture of a loved one. It might be someone who's passed away. It's instantly one of these products that when advertised in a really kind of emotionally effective way on social media, it captures a lot of attention. Or if I was to show you this product here, which is basically just a personalized um, keychain of somebody's pet. It could be a past pet, it could be a current pet, it has their name on, it has their actual um, picture sketched onto stainless steel or gold stainless steel or 925 silver. Again, this is a product that's been around for many, many years, but this is also a product that many people would consider saturated. It's also a product that people would say doesn't work anymore. And what I would say to those people is you're not selling it in the right places. So if we head back onto flipper.com, I wanna show you Golden Memories. This is a Shopify dropshipping store that's currently for sale. It's been in business for two years. The average monthly profit is 9,000 US dollars, profit margin 30%, and they're currently running Meta Ads and Google Ads. If we drop down into their financial statistics for the past 12 months, we can see the annual revenue has been 360,000 USD with an annual profit of 108,000 USD. If we jump back to the top, we can see this is a verified listing as well. So if I just exit off this and hover over the top, you can see this, the numbers from the store have actually been vetted by Flipper, meaning that they should be legitimate. This is a very successful Shopify store that has not been in business for very long, which again shows one of the awesome, awesome things about dropshipping is how quickly you can scale things up when you find the right product and you get that initial traction, that by far is the hardest thing to do. Building a site, doing the product research, obtaining ad creative, launching ads, they are all the simpler and straightforward and easier things to do. But finding that initial product that gets the traction and where the whole, everything that kind of goes into the recipe of a successful business, and when it comes out and works, that is when the magic starts to happen and when things can change very, very quickly. Let's jump onto the Shopify store and then let's take a look at what a 100K profit store looks like. Um, it's a pretty generic store. One of the beauties and advantages of building websites and advertising in these countries that aren't as familiar with the dropshipping space is when they see stores like this, they don't instantly think Chinese dropshipping store, cheap products, it's gonna take weeks to arrive because it's not saturated. They're not used to seeing it. So everything is new and exciting to these people. If we take their very best selling products, which is this pet keychain, um, it's currently for sale for 160, I believe it's Brazilian dollars. Um, I've got a translator up here so 160 brazilian real is about 25 pounds so it fits perfectly into that kind of impulse buy range because it is a personalized product too that's made to order people will naturally expect to wait a couple of weeks in order for it to be made what i really 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 like about this business too is they have this a custom box a box with the logo on the store is called golden memories the box comes in a nice matte black finish with golden memories in a shiny gold by the looks of things which instantly sets it apart from anybody else trying to sell the same product it's these little touches that really help professionalize the brand and set them apart so if there is a consumer out there that's in two minds about whether to trust these guys or whether to order from these guys or the next people you're going to go for the people who have the custom packaging because it instantly looks more professional and therefore more trustworthy something else worth pointing out too is that if you have a store at the moment and you find that people aren't converting and you're selling these personalized products, it's really difficult sometimes to display the information or the instructions in a way that's easy for an audience to understand, especially when you're going after that older generation. 
So having these little sections like here, how to buy that lays out the instructions for them can really help and can really make a difference. So what does it take to generate 100K in profit? Then what do the ads look like on Facebook? So if you wanna see if any particular page is currently running ads, it's a very straightforward process. You go onto their Facebook page, you click the about, you go to page transparency, and it says here, this page is currently running ads. So this is a business that's still active and still working. The products you see are great products to sell now. But just keep in mind what I said at the beginning of the video, you may not want to sell them in the US or the UK or Australia or Canada. You'll have to do your own research and see see if the market has been flooded with these products already. If they have, stay away. Find another country where it's not flooded, which will typically be cheaper to advertise in as well. The cheaper it is to advertise as well, the more flexibility you have when it comes to scaling, and of course, the bigger profit margins too. So selling a product, for example, for $25 in Brazil or $25 in America, you get the same amount of money. Whereas if it costs you $15 to acquire your customer in America, but only $5 in Brazil, obviously you're gonna be making a lot more money. So try and find those cheaper audiences in countries that are still high quality enough to purchase the product, but have significantly lower CPMs. I did a video on this exact topic not long ago. So this page is currently running ads. We can click this button to go to the ads library, and it's gonna show us the exact ad creatives that these guys are using to generate those profitable sales we've seen they've been making. Some interesting things to point out is that they're very upfront about their delivery times. So it says they're 25 DS. I'm assuming that's referring to when it's going to arrive because it's a personalized product. Like I said, it's not an issue in the consumer standpoint. Another thing worth pointing out as well is that by the looks of it, they have an offer 50% off. That's that opening line. I do not speak Portuguese, so I'm just gonna copy this into my translator and see what this says. The bracelet you'll never take off again. So it's just kind of like a generic statement. It just goes to show how powerful and how invested the audience is in the product. Let's play the actual video itself and see what this looks like. So there's no actual speech. There's music playing in the background. This is a video that they've probably taken from existing content online and just recycled. They've put over the top their own language, which instantly connects with the audience that they're gonna be targeting. Their audience is most likely used to seeing English speaking ads, which they probably switch off to instantly because it's not their home language, it's not their native language. Whereas by having that simple subtitle at the top there, instantly they're gonna think, oh, it's in the Portuguese language, something I've not seen before, I'm gonna see what this is. And the longer you can get somebody to watch your creative, the much more likely they are to buy it. Let's take a look at this one. So again, they've got the Portuguese subtitle. They've got the picture of the dog. Very similar throughout. And different options. And I think it just restarted then, or at least the music did anyway. By no means a uh, an expensive or complicated or heavily edited video. This is something you could probably get hold of already online and put your own subtitles on. I don't think this is original content that they filmed and obtained themselves for the sakes of selling their product. Let's take a look at this one. So maybe they did film that themselves. If they did, like how easy is this? You can film this yourself just by holding it up to your own wrist. You can get one made yourself for $5, get it delivered to your house and film this exact content in a couple of minutes. Just goes to show, I've seen this time and time again, simple often works best. Demonstrate exactly what the product is and what it does and do it yourself. Be original, try and use original content where possible. The reason why these guys get away with it is because they're selling it to a country where it's all fresh and new and people have not likely seen it before. And with that being said guys, that's everything I wanted to show you in this video. I showed you a winning product, I showed you a winning Shopify store, showed you winning ad creatives. All you've got to do now is go out there and find the country in which you want to sell this product to and then get to work. If you would like some one-to-one -one personalized help from myself, 
launching a business similar to this, then what you need to do is check out the links in the description below and click on that secret cool link. What it's going to do is going to take you to a series of questions, five or six very quick, easy to answer questions before it then takes you through to my calendar where you can select a date and time for me and you to jump on a Google Meet. It's super important you answer those questions in as much detail as possible. So number one, I know that you're serious. I only want to work with serious people, of course. That's the reason for putting this message at the end of the video. I don't want every man and his dog booking up my calendar, wasting my time. If you've watched my video to the end, then you're probably somebody who's serious about building a legitimate business like this that's going to change your life for the better. So if that is you, then I want to work with you. To do that, click on one of those links in the video description below. Fill out those questions so I can get to know where you're at now, where you want to be in two to three months time. And if you have a realistic goal that I believe I can help you achieve, it will let you go through to my calendar where you can book a date and time where we can have a chat in more depth. Cheers and see you on the call. Thanks.